so I did a tutorial for you today and this is my go-to daytime smoky eye. I do this look all the time when I have just a few extra minutes in the morning and I want to look kind of put together but not like overly done dramatic smoky eye type look and it's just kind of like a really soft grayish silver smoky eye with very peachy cheeks and neutral lips and it's super easy very affordable and if you want to see it then just keep watching first off I'm just priming my lids I'm just gonna use a cream shadow base and I'm gonna take the Maybelline um, color tattoo eyeshadow in toughest taupe super duper pretty like steely gray color and I'm gonna smooth that over the lid and I'm gonna start out closest to the lash line and just really lay that color down and I'm gonna blend it up to the crease and once I get to the crease I'm gonna take a clean finger and go right over the edge of the cream shadow just to make sure that I can blend it out and still be fairly neat about it and for this look um, I like to give it a little more um, depth and dimension, so I'm going to go over it with powdered shadow. And I'm going to take this Revlon Color Stay Quad in Goddess. And I'm going to take this Shimmery Silver Color. And I'm just going to tap this color over that cream base. I'm just using padding motions. I don't know if you all can hear that. Um, that's Sammy snoring. <laughs> He's laying underneath my chair fast asleep. So now I'm just going to do what I always do. And you all, I promise in the next tutorial, I won't use a brown shade in the crease. I feel like I do that every time. I hope you all don't get sick of it. The reason is because I like the balance I get with this cool toned silver and this warm toned brown. I just really like the combination of those two. So I'm going to take this color Naked by Urban Decay with a big fluffy brush and I'm going to apply that to the crease. And I'm just going to use this shimmery highlight shade right here. Apply that under the brow. Then I'm just going to take the little sponge tip applicator that comes in the quad, go back into that highlight shade and apply this around the tear duct. I'm going to go back to my flat shader brush that we used to apply the lid color and just dip the tip of it into the silver shade and I'm going to apply that along the lower lash line. Then go into this darker charcoal shade, just barely and apply that to the outer third just for some added definition to your eye shape. That's it for the shadows. So for my lower waterline, um, sometimes I just leave it blank. If you want a more dramatic daytime look, you can line your waterline with a black pencil or a flesh tone color. I do that a lot. Um, I just have this one near me and it's just a white pencil. Gonna make you look a little more awake. Just apply that. And for the upper lash line, I really like to wing out my liner with this look. Um, if you want to be more subtle about it, you can just line your um, upper lash line with a pencil and smudge it out. But I like to wing out my liner because it just helps my eye shape because they can tend to look a little heavy and saggy. So um, you can use a gel or a liquid liner. I'm just going to use Maybelline Line Stiletto. And I do make a really thin line across the lash line, and then I'm just going to wing it out just a little bit at the end. Now your lashes are going to make all the difference in this look. As you can see, it really helps to define your eyes a little better. So I'm going to curl my lashes, and I'm going to apply Maybelline The Falsies Volume Express Mascara. And I like to do about two coats of mascara. And also just apply a thin coat to your lower lashes. And that is it for the eyes. So if you want to see what I do on the rest of my face, I'll zoom out and I'll show you. So I already have on my blush, bronzer, and lipstick. So I'm just going to show you what I use for that. 
So when I do this eye look, I generally like to go for kind of like a peachy look on the rest of my face rather than pink. Pink will still work, but I don't know, I just prefer like the neutral peachy tones. So I just went all over my face with the e.l.f. warm bronzer. And it has like four colors in here and I mainly use like these two and they're kind of shimmery too so it gives you a nice glow. And I just took a huge big fluffy brush like this and I went all over my cheeks, my temples, my jawline and I took it down my neck too so that my face would match my neck. And then for blush I just apply this right on the cheekbones. I use this Tarte Amazonian Clay uh, blush in Peaceful and it's kind of just like a peachy color. And I love this blush and I just applied it right there and then for my lips the only thing I'm wearing is MAC lipstick in Viva Glam 5 and it's just a very natural neutral kind of your lips but better color so that is the finished look I really hope you like it and I hope you give it a try and I think it's perfect for a daytime appropriate smoky eye so thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time